So I think up to recently, one of the largest or longest IRs that was available was in the Strymon Iridium of like the modern day modelers and stuff. And that could load an IR of 500 milliseconds. Now, Fractal Actifex 3 can now load IRs of 1.3 seconds, I think. Um, and this is kind of a new sort of take on where we're going with IRs. And I think the crux of it is that it's trying to address that issue of the amp in the room conundrum. You'll remember on the Strymon Iridium, the way that they kind of tackled this, as well as having a long IR, was at the end of the signal chain you've got a room reverb and you could turn up that room sound. Now in the Helix world you've got something like the Reflections, which I guess is doing a similar sort of thing, but Cliff is saying that essentially these longer IRs are maybe going to be the new way to tackle this sort of stuff. So, how does it actually sound? So here's so here's the sound of just the direct cab. I think I'm using factory cab 106. Now if I switch on the IRs, so these are the full res IRs. So for me what I'm noticing is that I get quite a change in the actual tonality of what's going on. So this is with the room IRs. And then this is with that. Okay, so I've just had a look and I think basically there's about a 3 decibel, maybe a little bit more volume drop when I switch to the the cab which has the full res cabs panned left and right as well. So I've just corrected for that and so hopefully... That's 
direct. And here's with the full res. sound like it's an amp in the room to you. Here's without. So here's the same kind of test but with them all the way up to 0 dB. So hopefully now the room cab should be as loud as the direct cap so that's like the least subtle So the way to load these, go to the link which I'll put in the description and then you load these in via uh, Axe Edit and you go to the Manage Cabs and there'll be like a little tab for full res cabs, load them in there and then they'll be in, in the cab block, they'll be in slots 3 and 4. So hopefully that will help you with that. So. <laughs> Could be useful, it's interesting to see where that goes. I think we need to wait until some more people have started to do uh, kind of more room mic -y things. I don't know if there's like a, a massive amount of IRs of this length available in the world, um, but... <laughs> sounds more like an amp in a room or could you just use a reverb I don't know certainly without that high I think it's quite a noticeable effect what do you think